so I'm just on my way into central London. Um, I woke up this morning feeling a bit kind of crappy and low, and my mood's been really affected today. Um, I didn't sleep particularly well last night. I kept waking up. I didn't actually properly fall asleep until about three in the morning, and then I woke up at like seven and just couldn't go back to sleep. It was really rough. Um, and it's really affected my mood, so I've been kind of in a weird mood all day. So I thought, what have I been learning from CBT if I do something that I enjoy? And then I thought, you know what? It's been ages since I've been to the cinema. I'm gonna go to the cinema. So I'm currently on my way into central London now. Um, I'm gonna stop by Kiki K because the station here makes me happy. Um, and I also have decided that I wanna give bullet journaling a try. So those are my two things. Go to the cinema and get a bullet journal. That's all for me. So I've just left the cinema. I went to go see Star Trek Beyond um, and I just feel like infinitely better. I just, I don't know, I woke up in, this, in the morning and I was just in such a funk, but now I actually feel like I'm really happy, I'm in a great mood, my mood has completely changed and it's because I made that executive decision to get up and get out of the house. Um, and to be honest, that's kind of like what the CBT has been teaching me. So I'm really glad that it's worked. And now I've got some time to go before work, but I feel like it's gonna be a good rest of the week now. Good morning guys, happy Tuesday. So um, what am I doing today? Uh, I started bullet journaling, I spent the morning doing that a bit um, and I'm gonna do a blog post about it so I'll probably take a few pictures in a few minutes um, and then I'm off to meet Jay, we're gonna be up in Camden. I've got another blog post that I'm working on about Camden so that'll be really good. Um, but my mood this morning is like infinitely better than yesterday. I think I woke up yesterday in such a crappy mood um, and just feeling really low and feeling kind of bummed out. But I got out of the house, I went to the cinema, I rewarded myself for accomplishing a few things I wanted to accomplish yesterday, and it completely changed my mood around, and it's just continued into today. So, yay! Um, and it's nice and sunny outside, which definitely helps. Um, I should probably go pick up some sunscreen, because I don't think I have any. But, um, yeah, exciting day ahead. It's very sunny, so I'm out just to meet Jay. I'm um, just up to Camden. I'm kind of excited though, to just like sit out in the sun and kind of enjoy it. I'm also hoping that um, sitting in the sun will help get rid of this horrendous farmer's tan that I've got. I don't know if you can see it, but it's like, my shoulders are a completely different color from my arm. Just from sitting in the sun, like when we went to the pub for Phil's birthday, we were just sitting in the sun, and literally. So I've got this terrible farmer's tan. So hopefully I'll be able to alleviate that a bit today which would be good. Um, plus, I'm just looking forward to hanging out. Maybe I'll get some ice cream from Chin Chin Labs. If you've never been there, it's amazing. So yeah. We got, what did we get? We got halloumi fries, mm -hmm. we got masala fries, 
and we got avocado toast and we got margarita pizza so I think we're pretty much good I don't think I've ever been as happy as I am in this moment right now <laughs> trying to vlog and take the pizza at the same time is really difficult oh, I mean kind of what <laughs> that's really good that's good I've just been, um, I'm just in Bromley right now. Um, I just finished CBT. I've got, this is week five of six. It's gone by really fast, actually. Um, so now I'm just gonna head into central London. But I am, what am I saying right now? I don't even know. Um, anyway, CBT's been going really well. It's very helpful. And I've not really been feeling as low in the last few weeks as I have been previously. Um, and even on Monday when I was feeling really low, I feel like I actually have the tools to, um, change it which is really good so we had an interesting chat today about thoughts and behaviors and things so carry on to next week uh, and next week's the last week so let's come to that actually to Sainsbury's and um, I'm gonna spend the day baking some cookies one of my bosses at work is leaving so we decided to have a little kind of like afternoon tea type thing and I thought I would bake some cookies um, and then bring in ice cream so everyone can make ice cream sandwiches because it's been really really hot so I thought that would be like a good morale booster so I'm just off to Sainsbury's um, and I'm working from home today so it's been kind of a relaxed day uh, Phil's home as well he's got the week off work so yeah Ooh. Bit of sunshine. It's really hot out, it's very muggy. Um, I didn't quite finish the cookies because, well, it was so warm that the dough kind of just kept melting, so they're in the fridge until tomorrow morning, and they'll be baked fresh for ice cream sandwiches. So I'm just down in Clapham this morning. I'm just going to get some fabric, because um, uh, one of my tasks this month is to make some curtains for our flat for the lounge and for the bedroom. So I'm just on my way to Clapham um, to the fabric shop to buy fabric so I can make curtains. Woo! Um, it's so much nicer out today. Yesterday it was like really humid and gross, but today it's actually nice and comfortable. So I thought I would bust out this old reliable, which I haven't worn in months. And by months I mean like almost a year, probably something. But anyway, yeah, that's all I'm up to today. Well, for now, might go out and about a bit later, but we'll see. here at John Lewis um, on my way to the Etsy pop-up shop I absolutely love Etsy so any chance I get to actually shop them in person is amazing and John Lewis um, has a pop-up shop 
on their roof pretty much for the weekend because it's a bank holiday weekend. Sorry, I was just looking at this handy little thing. Um, but yeah, let's go see what they've got.